definitely not these two. I think it's the front tire. Okay, so we document everything. So you got your ID on you, or? I must have security. I just lost my ID. You what? Lost my ID. Okay. <laughs> we are you going it? out so late? It's like what two two something in the morning. Yeah, I know. I know. I have a baby daddy. My, oh. I just dropped her off. Gotcha. All right. Let me let me make sure. Are you valid? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Let me let me make sure all that's good. Tara, have you been drinking? I have not. I like had a couple drinks like two hours ago, but that's it. I can smell it. Yeah, I dropped my child off to my baby daddy, okay. and then I had two beers, and then what time? Uh, Heineken's, two Heineken's, what and time? then um, probably around one. And All right. I'm just going I know. right um, here. Let me check your eyes because I, no, here's I the thing, I'm, I'm not going to follow you home you. if you're not able. And no, I can drive, I promise. My observations in terms of like if you're not able to drive, I can't like, I'm, I'm, no, I, I'm I legally. No, I promise you I, like, I wouldn't drive, like I have a child, I would not fuck that up I'm like on my own. But I'm legally like obligated to. I, I can't let you drive, and I can't let no, observe I you driving no, I if I that, believe 100%. you may be under the influence. You know what I mean? Yeah, no, I understand. So I 100%. can't let you drive if I think you're too I intoxicated. I promise you, my house drive. is like that, but I only had two Heinekens, and I didn't even drink and, the full And that's one. it is what it is, but I need to make sure you're not under the influence, so you can drive. Yeah, no. Okay. 100%. Does that make sense? I have a that's, child. I would rather that's all I want to do. Okay. Than like right. get in trouble. So let's let's go back here, all right. I'm not trying to like hem you up or nothing, no, no, but no, you know no, what I mean? I'm like not, no, I hope I, know, I, know. I hope that makes sense. Like I can't no, I literally follow just someone off. home if if they've been drinking, you know what no, I mean? No, I just so. asked if you wanted to follow home if you did not believe And if me. if I check you out and yeah. these tests go okay, then I yeah, will 100%. follow you. Home. Okay. Well you don't have to. <laughs> well I like, wanna make sure you I'm... don't break down on the road again. So Yeah. Go over here, stand in front of my bum. Actually, you know what? We're going to go I over here completely had, out of the I'm a D1 road. soccer player. I yeah. have had two Achilles or constructive okay. surgeries. So, That's, like, my heels are shit. Don't basically okay. have feelings. Let's go them. over here. Go go over here. I'm going to turn okay. these little flashy lights off because I don't want us in the road doing this stuff. All right, come, I know, little... come over here. All right, so you got... This, this is like a Sorry, crack I'm up. medically disqualified. My shoes are untied. <laughs> you can take your shoes off if you want. I don't no, care. that's too much okay. work. I'm, I'm just not, giving you the no. option. It feels so it feels I gotta ask you a few them. things. Have you um, had any like recent head trauma, like serious concussions? Nope. Um, do you wear glasses or contacts? I do, but okay. I do not have my glasses on me. No contacts on. Huh? Uh, just because I can't get them in my eyes, so no. Okay. Um, anything that prevent you from following this with your eyes? Um, only astigmatism in this eye. That's it. Okay. That's the only reason I have glasses. Like a resting? It's kind of a oh, lazy eye. I'm sorry. I thought you said astigmatism. astigmatism. No, astigmatism. Gotcha. Yeah. Okay. It's, it's more of a lazy eye. So okay. That's the only All right. So what I'm going to have you do, and I know it's cold. I'm more I'm, cold myself. Yeah, my tits are cold. <laughs> okay. So what I want you to do is put your hands up here on your cheeks. And keep your head straight, okay? I Follow. can press them how you just did. You don't I'm have sorry, to I'm press nervous. Them. Cops make me nervous, but you seem cool. No so. need to be nervous. All right, so okay. put your hands here. Follow the tip of my pen with your eyes and your eyes only, okay? Sorry, Look I don't know what I'm doing. What are the rules? Like, just, just follow just, the pen with my eyeballs, yep, not my head. Just your eyes, gotcha. not your head, all right? Okay. Make sense? I'm sorry. All right, no, you're good. All right, go ahead and put your hands right here for me. My head is moving and I'm not meaning for it to. Just keep following it. It's I'm fine. Sorry. You're good. You're good. Okay. Keep following it. All right. It's going up. Just keep following. Keep your head straight. All right. 
Alright, stay there. It's gonna look like my pen's gonna touch your nose, I swear it's not, okay? Just keep following, alright? One more, alright. I can't touch my big old nose. I'm not. Alright, so there's going to be two more things I'd like to do, okay? The next is, have you ever done this before? Okay. Let's, uh, let's get on more of a flat surface, alright? So let's, uh, let's go over here, alright? Okay. Let's, uh, we're so going to... Achilles reconstructive surgery. I barely have nerve damage. That's fine. I'll take that in consideration. Any right? my feet, okay? So go over here, alright? We're going to use this line right here, alright? I can so, do that, yeah. Alright. So what I'm going to have you do is put your left foot on the line with your right foot in front. Keep your arms down by your side and don't begin the test until I tell you to do so. Does okay, that make can sense? Can you hold this in my big old sweatshirt? Okay. Yeah, that's fine. Or I can put it on the ground. I'm sorry. It's my dad's sweatshirt. We just came back from Kinzana not too long. Holy cow. Okay. That, I'm, gonna, I'm just going to lay this on the ground, okay? I don't want to drop this stuff. That's a lot. Is it okay if I just... All right. Yeah, All right, so like I said, put your yeah, left foot on the yeah. line with your right foot in front with your... Well, my shoelace is starting to have some off-whites on. About That's four, fine, you can tie them in I don't like to tie them because I don't want to ruin the shoelaces, but that's okay. All right, so like I said, put your left foot on that line with the right foot in front of the left. Why is there another cop here? Because I don't have a flashlight. But you just put another one out, okay? This this is a phone. Alright, so I like I listen, you put your left foot on the line with your right foot in front. Your arms down by your side. Don't begin this test talk till I do so. Does that make sense? Yeah, what do you want to do? Okay, I'm gonna explain that. What I want you to do is take nine heel to toe steps down. One, two. Hey, go go back. I told you don't don't begin until I tell you. Okay, damn. Right, Stay right. back. Stay There's back. rules to this, okay? Yeah. Alright, so let's, can I use your, <laughs> my, flashlight my flashlight died. Gave out in the middle of him. Right, right in the middle of all of us. Nice. So like I said, put your left foot on the line, left foot on the line, Sorry, with your right I'm foot in front of your left. Okay. Alright, so what I want you to do. This is so not fair, okay? I have like thirty percent of an Achilles. Okay, this is not fair. I told you I'm gonna take that into consideration, okay? <laughs> so maintain that position until I tell you to do so. Okay. You understand? Okay. okay. What I want you to do is take nine heel to toe steps down on that ninth step. I want you to take a series of small steps and return nine heel to toe steps. Like backwards it's gonna, return or like no. both. No, you're going to do like those, line. you're going to take a small series of steps and you're going to return nine, coming down the opposite way, forward, okay? okay? So I'm, I'm going to demonstrate, okay? It's going to look like this. No, I got One, it. I'm not, I'm not retarded. Two, three. You can um, I did, do it. Look at your heels. Why are you shaking? It's cold. And then you're going to take the series of small steps and you're going to return. One, two, three. Nine. I got it. I got it. Okay. Does that make sense? I, it makes perfect sense. Okay, sense. go ahead. Sorry, left heel first to my right one. Okay. Next, what I'm gonna have you do is uh, face me with your uh, arms down by your side, feet parallel. Parallel. There you go. What I'm gonna have you do? Um, don't. We'll start this. Once again, until I tell you to do so, okay? Right. You understand? Yeah. All right. Well, what I'm going to have you do is uh, raise one leg, either leg of your choosing, approximately six inches off the ground, and that's going to be parallel to the ground. What I want you to do is look down at your toe and count out loud in the following manner, 1,001, 1,002, and so on, until I tell you to stop. Okay? okay. It's going to look like this. This Someone... is so unfair. Achilles reconstructive surgery. Okay. I we... told you, this is the third time. I've been for five years, okay? I have 30% hey, of an Achilles. It's going to look like this, okay? 1,001, okay. 1,002, okay, and so on. 1,001, 1,002, 
1005, 1006, 1007, 1008, 1009, 1009, 1009, 1009, 1009, 1009, 1009, 1009, 1009, 1009, 1009, 1009, 1009, 1009, 1009, 1009, 1009, 1009, 1009, 1009, 1009, 1009, 1009, 1009, 1009, 1009, 1009, 1009, 1009, 1009, 1009, 1009, 1009, 1009, 1009, 1009, 1009, 1009, 1009, it's not like admissible or anything in court okay, or anything like that. I guess not. I just okay, have to get that, home. That's fine. My mom, she's bitching me out. I literally live right here. I promise I drank two Heinekens and I didn't even drink the second one because it was absolutely gross. Okay, let me explain a few things. Um, there's a few <laughs> things that were concerning on this test to me. One, two. Honestly, when he pulled me over, I'm not even about to lie. I was changing a song on my phone, okay. so I was. Well, you, you've got bloodshot, glassy eyes, your speech is slurred, um, I, I smell take, alcohol coming off your breath. I do take Adderall okay. and Xanax, but zero. Have you taken that twice. recently? I did take my Xanax about... When's um, the last time you smoked? Smoked? Weed. Uh, Marijuana. Probably about four hours ago, five okay. hours ago when I was at work and I left work and was is that triway drive. Is going to be some in your car? Because uh, I, I feel like I can smell it. No, but it probably does stink because my clothes and everything does reek. I'm going to be honest with you. Okay. Everything reeks. My friends, they they reek. Um, I just moved from Cogdale, Betty Lane, mm -hmm. back to my mom's house because me and my baby's father had a domestic violence um, incident. I got punched in the face. I broke my orbital bone and socket. So I was okay. like, okay, time to move home. But yes, everything in my car... Like, if you look in it right now, it is bags of shit, and it all reeks, like... Okay, well, Tara, I, like you how? shouldn't be driving this evening. I'll just be honest with you. Okay. So... I'm sorry, I have... Th listen to me. This is what's going to happen. Okay. I'm going to take you to my office. We're going to do some paperwork. I'm going to give you the opportunity to drive a sample, whether that's through urine or through breath. It's up to you. You don't have to. However... If I urine... Yeah. I promise I will fail for marijuana, 100%. Okay. Like, I came from so, two miles down, and I came up. What I want to do is get just, out of this cold and get out of the road, too. So. I'm just very scared because I have a two-year-old daughter that mm -hmm. lives literally at this house right mm -hmm. here. Like, I, you can check my ID. Who's home with her? My mom. Okay. And she just recently had a heart attack. So that, listen, I'm not going to make this harder than where we're at. No, I know. However, I think you something is going on, whether it's a drugs or alcohol or a combination uh, of I'm them. not on drugs. Other than Big Farm, which my Adderall and my Xanax. So listen, I'm, like I said, I'm not going to make this harder. However, per policy, okay. I do have to put you in handcuffs when we transport you to my office. Can when we get there, listen, can, I, I'm, when we I'm, get I'm, there... I'll, I will take those cuffs off as long as you're cool with me and you're cool with everyone I'm else. I'm very cool with it. Okay. But can we please just call my dad? I literally live we, right here. Please. We can do that once we get to my office. We're not going to do that in the roadway. Okay. Do I have to go to your office? I'm please. I'm. Yeah. I'm sorry, but like I'm. So Tara, this is. I am such this a is a the good deal. Person okay. I'm not saying you're not. However, I think there's a few mistakes you made tonight, which is operating your car under the influence. I agree with the reason why I was doing that is because I was changing my song. Please, so I have a listen, daughter that I Tara. can't lose. What if she goes to my abusive ass baby daddy? Tara, what? I lose everything. This is what's going to happen. I'm going to place you in handcuffs. We're going to go in my car to my office. When we get there, I'm going to offer you the those, those tests. Am I going to have to save the night in jail? You are not. As I'm long not as, listen, listen. As long as, well, Tara, listen, let me talk. As I'm long sorry, as you I'm, don't make I'm it harder very, on very us and you don't re Anna. say resist arrest or anything crazy, never, I'm not taking you to jail, okay? I will never right. resist you. Okay, so listen, I know scared. this is going to so be hard, but I got to put you in cuffs, myself. okay? So do turn have around. To, I, I do. Get in my turn in your Tara, car willingly. Turn around, please. I have to. I have to. Okay, so turn around, please. 
This is short lived, okay? This is only going to be a few minutes. Yes, you will. Like I said, I'm not taking you to jail as long as you don't like fight us or anything crazy I like never that. Fight okay, you. and good. I don't ever, want. I don't want to do that. Ever in my life would I ever fight you? Okay. Or like perfect thing, but like I. Just, God damn! Like I literally can't go 24 hours without happening something happening to my ass. I swear to God, I'm a good person. I'm not saying you're not. I, I just had think... two Heinekens and I was so honest with you. And I appreciate it. My house is right there. My two-year-old daughter. You promise I'm is not there, gonna stay there, there. I know. Is there anything in the vehicle that you need tonight out of your out of your car? Um, no, you have house, it. house keys, anything like that. Can I park my car in the back of here and my dad will come get it? It's literally nope. right there. So that's not. That's against our policy. So we're following our policy at this point. Is there anything in the vehicle that you need tonight? Okay. Let's go. Let's go over here. Okay. Well, um, this is, listen, this is going to take an hour, if that, okay? And then when we get done, someone's, you guys bring someone's got to come get you. So that I can oh, yeah, right here. Um, can my car be moved out of the way? You're going to move that, right? Per policy, we have to tow it. I, I have no say in that, and I'm not violating God, our policy. Damn. You know how much I just paid for daycare for my kid? I'm sure it's expensive. Can I have the flashlight? Yeah. Guys, I really don't like this. Tara, please have a seat. Can you, can you put that in the front floorboard? I don't know what it like, I, just, I, don't Tara, know. I can't. I like, can't. Have a hug. I know you have to do what you have to do, but fuck. Like, please, I'm very please. scared. Can you have a seat? I, I understand. This is hard, I'm okay? Not, like a troubled kid. I didn't say you were. I, I just know. think you made a mistake, I okay? I respect you guys. And like, can you. Huh? I can't put my foot on. Oh, I got it. Um, this is very weird for me because I've never been put in this situation. So I'm sorry that I'm crying, but it's kind of scary. Okay, well, this side. I'm gonna bring my shoulder back a little bit. Uh, Should I break on? Alright, let's, uh, you able to scoot over to the other side? That seatbelt's not working. Uh, in the middle or all the way all the way? I tell you what, all the way over. So we can use that seat belt. If not, just come out and go around. Let's just go around. It'll be easier because there's something big in the way. Is it doing the same? No, it's just trying to get it. You just sit down in it. Yeah. Like I said, we'll be done with this in, in an hour, okay? Oh, this is a weird situation to be in. I understand. Um, what do I do when I get there? When what? When I get there, because obviously I admitted to you that I drank uh, one and a half Heinekens. I can't give you legal advice. Uh, and that's not me being mean. I, I li literally, I just don't. No, I don't think that you're being mean. I'm just a very open and honest and kind of eccentric person. Um, and there's my house. You'll be back in an hour, okay? Are you gonna take me back? What? Are you gonna have to take me back or am I gonna have to disappoint my dad more? If we don't have any other options, I can do that. Am I allowed to make a call off my phone? Yeah, when we're done with uh, the paperwork and everything, absolutely. Um, my house is right here to the right, this driveway right here. Um, God damn, I just feel like I'm doing my daughter so wrong. I have a two-year-old daughter, her name's Penelope Sage. She is, um, the best thing that I have ever had. Um, 
and this does not feel um like strong woman energy that I'm giving off. And this is embarrassing and disappointment to my daughter. Listen, this isn't the worst thing in the world. No, this it isn't is. like a, a felony. It I is. Like this, I just got my four year degree. This is the absolute worst possible thing that could have fucking happened. Like who, who's gonna give me career with this on my record? Like, and you know that. There's, there's lots of people that have view eyes. Trust me on that. Lots. I don't want a DUI though. I am a disappointment. This is disappointing as fuck. I don't like being in handcuffs. This is not me. This is a very weird and I don't think that I like it too much because they're very tight. Um, I'm not a criminal. I'm not a bad kid. So this is new. I didn't say you're a bad person or a bad kid. I know you're not a criminal. No, well, I know, but god damn. I'm going to give my dad a goddamn heart attack. I'm going to have to call him and he's going to have a fucking heart attack. I'm going to be the death of my father. Oh my god. And the shittiest part is this is going to be on my record, right? Potentially. Um, yeah. So I just put my NWLSN registration in the National Women's Soccer League. And racing will will pitch me up to be a player and if I have to my record, like that's done. That dream is done. Oh my god, Tara, what the fuck? Like now I feel so scared. Can I can I deny I guess a breathalyzer test? Because like I was cool with taking one, but then I'm like, whoa, okay now that I'm arrested. Tara maybe I said it's it's up to you. But like, what do I say? Like, I just want a lawyer present. They'll still let so me go So there's a form tonight. that we'll go over that explains all that, all right? So let's not try to get ahead of ourselves and I'll explain all of it. Like, am I gonna go to jail? Please don't make me no. go to jail. I will not last. I'll get my ass beat. I'm a little girl. You're not going to jail as long as you don't fight me or something crazy I like that. I would never do that. Didn't say you would. I'm just saying that's the only way you would go to jail. I'm so scared right now. <laughs> I've never done this before. So when I go in here, I can deny things. But yeah, obviously, I'm going to get a court date. Yeah, you will. But my dad can come still pick me up tonight because now I don't feel... Yeah. I don't feel comfortable taking a breath or that you arrested me. No offense. Like, I'm not, like, putting that against you. But, like, you are an officer. Like, you have a duty. And I understand that, like, but I don't understand my rights and I don't know them, so I don't want to do something that will fuck me up later. Like, I have so much on the line right now. And, oh my fucking god, I just fucked my chances up of playing professional soccer. <laughs> I just fucked myself over. Do you have my phone in vapes or just that other guy? Hold on. What did you say? I said, do you have my phone in vapes or just the other officer? I got it right. Alright, so step on out. Let's, uh, we're gonna go through that door, so go behind my car here. When we go in here, um, take a right, like an immediate right. Actually, hold on. Take an immediate right, and then walk into the room on your right, right here.
one. Hey, is anyone at 2 5 that can run a test for me? What kind of test? This thing. It's a breath machine. So that's like an official machine. I don't know how else to describe it. Oh, go ahead and stand up. Let me get those off you. Yeah, I told you I would. So. Thank you. They really hurt when Hold on. Why is this not there? Alright. Pull out of that. There you go. Alright. Right. You can have it. So I'm not. Like, what do you mean a right? I, listen, legally, I, le life, legally, I, I have to give you. I have to offer it to you. Like, there are certain things that I have to do. You're allowed to. So, go ahead and read it to her. That's what I'm looking for. So take this. So I have to read this to you too as well. All right, That's there's fine. some administrative yeah. stuff we have to do. So this is going to be the consequences of the refusal of the test. Okay. So you're now at arrest for operating a vehicle out under the influence alcohol of alcohol, drugs, or a combination of. So at the bottom it explained if if you refuse a chemical test, my um, license gets suspended until I go to court. Well, it's suspended regardless if you do or don't. What it's saying is if you refuse to provide a test, it could be a longer suspension. So, for example, um, with no priors, um, suspension could be 90 days. And you have no, no priors, is that correct? So, so what he's saying to you, you look confused. No, you, I, I understand it. So it's if just you, like I told if him. If you provide a breath sample today, which is what he's going to ask you, and you blow no. over 0 0.08, you blow I over 0.08. I understand that, but I told him yeah. that I drank a Heineken and a half. Uh -huh. So I'm afraid to do that, and I know that I probably right. shouldn't so, play that because you're cops, but like I have so, so much on the line. So you have myself. to you have to make a decision here, okay? Because and this is so if hard you either hard. so listen so listen to me, okay? I want you to track what I'm throwing down to you. Okay? Right, here you are. Here All right, if you are over no eight, okay, your license is gone. Why'd you turn it off? I didn't know it was on. I already turned it on. I didn't know it was on. Anyways, go ahead and hit the start button on me. All right. So, um, yeah, I, I guess my traffic didn't go over my one that I already turned it on. Oh, no, it is. So, um, so if you blow over the 08, it's a 90-day suspension, okay? If you refuse to provide that, it is a year. You're, it's gone a year, all right? If you blow under the 08, there's no license suspension, and then you have to appear on the court date with no license suspension, we call you a ride, someone comes here and picks you up. Okay? I just don't know what to do. So there's just the increased point. penalties there's if you refuse. increased no, 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 penalties I if you refuse. No, no, I understand that, but I don't know what point eight. Point oh eight. Point oh eight. One beer, two beers, three beers. Like That's based what? on the person and what you're, and I'm, what you've drank. So, I'm five and 120 yeah. pounds, and so I'm we more can't give of a you, smoker than I am. Yeah, so we can't a give drinker. you legal. Yeah, we can't give you legal advice. But, but we're I also offering, take Adderall and okay. prescription Xanax, which I can provide for you. Okay. All right. So you need to make a decision. This is a yes or no here or now, administratively, whether or not you want to blow in that machine or not. I'm going to say this to you. But okay. I do want to, but I. Well, Ooh, you, you have to make that decision, okay? Regardless of whether or not you provide a sample or not, we're going to call you a ride to come get you, okay? So you're going to go home regardless if you choose to provide or not, okay? So you but just, I have to enter information into that system there once it's done warming up, and you have plenty of time to sit here and chew on this and make a decision, but as soon as I ask you for a breath sample, you're going to have three I, minutes. I want to give it. So you I have... I really, truly, 
fucking do. Yeah. But like, I am um, an NWSL soccer player. Okay, I, under, I, I understand that. So you have to. So you have to weigh that decision when I ask you to provide a sample or not. When I start that machine, you're going to have three minutes to provide. If you do not provide a sample in that three minutes, it's an automatic refusal, and your license is gone for a year. Okay. Like no matter what a judge says, no matter it's gone. anything. Administratively, no this is gone. This is I gone. I couldn't go to soccer. It's a refusal. I couldn't go to anything. Yeah, ultimately, it's up to the judge. Okay, but you got to make up the decision. The BNB is saying when you signed your license, you're going to agree to provide a breath a breath sample to us, and if you don't, this is what's going to happen to your driver's license. Administratively. Immediately. So you have 90, you, if you blow over the 08, it's 90 days, and I'm sure you could ask for suspensions or privileges okay, pertaining to, okay? If you refuse, one year, okay? So, like I said, you got a little bit of time to chew on it. How long does this take? Well, it was ready to go before you put the fire much. button. <laughs> You it's said totally press fine. button to start yeah. test, so I'm like, yeah, yeah, I have to start the start test I button. I 100% yeah. want to do this. Right. For you guys, because I need well, myself. It's not for me, it's for you. So, And it's not for Officer Tudor either. You have to make a decision as your, as your person, as your person, is this what I need to do or not? Okay? Like, you're not doing any of this for me. I don't care if no, you blow in that. I don't care if you blow in that machine or not, and neither does Officer Tudor. Okay, but you're no, your own you person. Don't. You're it's your. But like what's running through my head. Sorry, I'm very No, you're emotional. fine. You're fine. Like drunk or not, and I'm not drunk. I hope yeah. you guys know that I had a hiding can. I got a hiding can. Mm -hmm. I had a hiding can and a half. Like I yeah. think I, like there was this much left of it. Mm -hmm. I drove two miles. Yeah, where were you and drinking then, at? Um, over at Tyler Lung's house, he lives like by the bowling alley, right when you get to the bowling alley, turn Donna right. Donna J Drive? I don't Eastgate know Lanes? No, 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 no. Oh, yeah, Eastgate Lanes, Lanes is the bowling, bowling alley. alley. But if you turn left up there mm -hmm. and go right up the hill past the trailer parks to the stop sign, okay. there is a neighborhood right to your right. Okay. This direction. Yeah, Cook Okay. Down the hill. Yeah, okay. So he lives off a of Deerfield is where you were drinking. I don't even know. Mm -hmm. it's been like the only hill that I can think of over there is uh, Deerfield, where it goes up a little bit and two trailer parks yeah. on the left. Yeah. Okay. I've just been um, a little emotional. And that's fine. Um, okay. And I just, but I yeah, want to reassure I, you I, that, I that, um, that your decision here is not going to impact whether or not you're going home so tonight. Sure. But you just need to make a decision. This is not a... This is not one of these ones that we're gonna we're gonna sit and chew on forever. But you have a little time until that machine says I can start plugging information in to chew on and make the decision. But as soon as I start this test, you're gonna have three minutes to make the decision. And if you don't, or if you fiddle if you I, fiddle I, fart I, around with the machine, it's gonna be a it's gonna be a refusal. So. I just, this isn't a, one of those things we're going to wait around all day for, but no, you have no, the time, I, you know, but, you know, you're an adult. This is a, this is an adult decision to make on your own to, to decide if you're going to uh, provide a sample or not. So, as this thing slides through, Officer Tudor, do you have a driver's license? Um, no, because it's expired, but I do have my social security number. Okay. I turned 27 I guess, on Saturday. Uh, probably the majority of them over here. Well, I guess so. Hey, uh, so... Got the driver's license number. You got the birth. You got all that on the... Sweet. I'm going to fail for marijuana. I don't Sorry. Know. Well, we'll run... The, we can run this. Yes, and yep, yep. But I don't know if I want to run this, because listen to, like, what's on the line for I, me. I, I... Like, what, I didn't okay. get your Tara. Is yeah, it Tara? Tara. Tara. Listen, I I understand that you have a lot going for you. Okay, I but you need to this. you need to make a decision and and, and just go and go with whatever you want to do with it. So like I'm just I don't know like I'm nervous like I want to do this for you guys so I can show you. So you are twenty. I'm gonna be twenty seven on Sunday. Tw oh, all right. So we're twenty six until Sunday. Okay.
but is it worth it just to have my driver's license right, three, 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 to spend to go? So you said back to my team in place. Sixty. Race in Louisville where we drive buses, and I really don't need a car. And you said you play for Louisville. What? Uh, racing Louisville. Racing Louisville. Where's that? At? In Louisville. Yeah. <laughs> I don't. I don't know female MLS soccer. So. That's so I'm, sad. I'm. I'm learning. Did I'm learning some new that? stuff. That is very I, sad. I. I just. Me. I'm sorry. Okay. Soccer was not my sport growing up. So I I'm, get it because <laughs> I would never watch the, the NWA. Yeah. yeah I, I just. I. You know. I think there's a lot of talent there. It's just not my sport, you know what I'm saying? Hey, what was the expiration on her driver's license, the date? Okay, this one's super old, so... I'm um, better than it worth, right? Yeah, but I need the year. Can you go out and check leads? Yeah. Um, if you guys have my... Oh, just kidding. I need to find my face off. Um, that idea I had. Nah, that's okay. He can, uh, he can get it for me. Got fancy computers with that information Which on it. Hell, am I gonna go through if I refuse it? What do you mean? Like I don't know. Like would I have time to go get a lawyer? Maybe try to fight it. I don't know. I don't know what to do because I don't want to give up everything. I just work so fucking hard for. It. Like you know how much it took to get me here. Well, I can only imagine. Playing a professional sport, what that would like, take. I'm gonna fuck up if I have this on my fucking shit. They're gonna look at me and be like, um. How long really have you played for them? No, I just tried out this year because I I just had a baby. Mm -hmm. Um, I played for Eastern Kentucky University soccer for okay. um, four years. Had two Achilles reconstructive surgeries. Um, I have like 30% of my Achilles left. My feet are fucking just god awful. Um, I came and took my fifth year here at the University of Cincinnati. Won the national championship and then was going to go overseas to play. We found out I was pregnant. And then baby daddy turned out to be an abusive very abusive man, broke my orbital bone and socket, and that's when I was like, hey mom, mm -hmm. I'm gonna come home now, and she was like, thank you, we've been waiting for this call, let's go, so mm -hmm. I went home, and then my parents have pretty much just been in support of me, not, you said, well, sorry, what was it? 10 29 of 29. So, oh, she's still back. Yeah, I thought you said your license was expired. No, uh, okay, no, no, no. The, the actual one that button. I have in my car is the, expired. The one that I have that is valid is at home. Okay, do you have the citation number? Yeah. It is 370833. 370833? Yes. I wish you didn't have the citation number. Wish you lost it. Uh, time of uh, first observation? 212. Do you guys care if I call somebody right now? Like just to like get them up. We're almost done here and then you'll be able to call somebody as soon as we're done with this. Ten minutes. Probably close to that. Is there an officer named uh Gratch here? Yep. Not here right now, but yeah. Damn it. Let me Can guess I you. If his little brother could just come pick me the fuck up because we live right next to each other, that'd be just great. Is someone going to have to pay to pick me up from here? No. No. Just friend, family member, something like that to come get you. We'll be glad to call them for you, or you can call them. We'll get you a friend to call them. Where's my car going to go, and how much um, the hell is that going to He's going to go over that with now. you. He's going to go over with that once we're done with this. Um, I'm just here to... How much are you thinking? Okay, I just paid my kids Montessori daycare, which is about $450 fucking dollars. I have no idea how much it is. So, and I don't know which tow company took it. I'm only here to do this. Yeah, great. Thank you so I much, I know, I know. Officer, you you uh, can't read that, Flynn. Yeah. 
Alright, so um, I'm going to put... I'm, I'm going to deny this. Um, okay, so... Not to be a dick. I don't you know, give a not, shit whether or not you blow in it or not. Me, but, like, I just have so much on my life. I don't want to lose soccer. And it's, like, really the only thing. Alright, so the machine's going to run anyways because it's required to. It'll do a little air blank. And then as soon as it tells me that that's done, I'm going to mark this as a refusal. So your driver's license will be done for a year. So. Like, even if it does, says It's a BMV suspension. God damn it, what do I do? Like I said, I got three, you got three minutes. If you want to make it or not. If but not, I'm going to mark it. Well, if you feel like you're going to blow under, then blow. But what if I blow over it? What's the, what's I just what's explained to you. Define point eight. 0.08, it's what, that is the legal limit. That's the legal limit. Do you want to blow or not? If not, I'm going to mark it on. You got three, you got less than three minutes now. Fuck me. I mean, I do, but I don't. I do what I don't because I'm lightweight. If you know that you're going to blow I'm under. I'm fine. Like, I'm really If fine, you feel like okay. you're going to blow under, then do what you need to do, but okay, whether or not. but what if that number comes back or more and that's not We can play the what if. We can, we can fine. play. The what if game all day. This machine has been calibrated to test your alcohol. What this displays is going to be accurate. So if you're if you feel confident you're going to blow under, make the decision if you're going to blow or not. If you don't, it's an R. It doesn't matter to me. I'm going to press it, but you're running out of time if you are going to provide a sample. How many would it be playing? Like if I, like it it varies on the person, the weight, how much they drank. Everybody I tells like me they drank my one. BMI, my BMI. Everybody tells me they drank yeah, one. Yeah, why wouldn't they? You're fucking it, Exactly. Stop so like, do you want to do zero, this or not? But... Because I'm going to mark an R. Fuck. Okay. Um... You want to do it? You got to do it before the time runs out. It's going to be an R regardless. But if it goes over, then, then it's what? Then it's a 90-day suspension. Not a year? Not a year. If it blows up. Am I going to go to jail? Because no, I, I already it. told you. You're not going to jail regardless for this currently. All right, Let's go. It. I didn't do this shit. So, so go ahead and make it right here. Tight seal around that. Put your mouth there. Blow. So I tell you to stop. Like a big balloon. Like a big balloon. Blow, 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 blow. You're not blowing. You're... Come on. There we go. Blow, 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 blow. Keep blowing. Keep blowing. Keep blowing. Keep blowing. Keep blowing until I tell you to stop. You're... Keep blowing like you're blowing a balloon. Keep blowing, keep blowing, keep blowing, keep blowing. Got to keep blowing. Blow, 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 blow. Keep blowing, keep blowing, keep blowing, keep blowing. You're playing games with it. Blow. Blow, 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 blow. My face going fucking right. God damn, my face. You got to blow. Okay, ready? One, two, three, go. Blow. You're not blowing. I'm going to mark it as a refusal if you do not blow. You're playing games. All right. You're done. That's hard, dude. That's like harder than I've this done it. Every time I bait. do this test, i got to blow into okay, this thing. Bait. Jesus Christ. I'm like, <laughs> get that popcorn one. A soccer athlete, that was... Come on, okay, cardio! Soccer, yeah. soccer athlete, but I vape. Okay, I um, uh, smoked a little bit of marijuana, so, like, ask me if you think that I can fucking keep up with cardio mm. right now. 096, you are over. Awesome, so I sure refused. Well, that is your choice, but it's an 096. Listen, it's not the end of the not world. The end you, of the world. You don't, all this means is you're just going to have a little extra charge. Okay. You're not going to jail still. Nothing like that. Charge. Okay, so That's what, all that means. What's my next step and what do I do? Get a lawyer, clearly. I'm going to get your phone. Get your uh, vapes. Don't, my vapes? Va don't vape in here until you're, we're done. Okay. But you're going to go hang out in that room. You're going to try to get a hold of a ride. Yeah. I got to do paperwork while you're doing all that. Now That's going to take like 15, 20 minutes. Go? I need to know the lot. He that just my car walked went. out. It's either going to be Soros right. or Gay Heights, one of the two. Which is on. You're playing. You're playing. Do you know how Carl's blowing into that?
fucking shit. Hey, every time I get certified on this, I have to well, blow you, in you it too. Got it, yeah. I gotta blow into it too, so I know how much air it takes to blow into that. Hey, you know when a guy says, "Oh, blow this," you know, mm. come on, yeah. come on. Mm. All right, so like I said, have a seat in there. I've got 15, 20 minutes worth of paperwork. I know you. Why do I know you? Try to get a ride. All right. Okay, what time does the towing company open you guys now? The um, officer is going to look what time it's going to open. So then we can grab my car. We gotta go to this. But, um, we talked about that. I'm not going to these paperwork, so let me give you a call right back. Okay, thank you. Love you, bye. Can you scoot over here? Because you got to sign something. Yeah, I guess so. So this is just the license suspension. This is administrative. This is actually the form that I read to you. That thing. Got it. Yeah. yeah. So from you, I just need a signature here. It acknowledges that you got your copy, which I'll give you here in a second. Okay. The vehicle limit is point eight, and I blew a point nine. Point oh eight, and you blew a point oh nine six. So bad. So the limit. Finally, I'll I'll explain kind of a little more what that means in a second when we get to it. So yeah. just right here. This Am I going to have to go to, like, fucking Camp Allen? Are they going to make me go to I Camp have, Allen? I have no idea. I don't have anything to do with it after this. Okay, me signing this means what? Absolutely nothing. It just means I, you get your copy. And you understand that your license is suspended. Until your court date. So. When's the court date? Does it say on here? It's going to be, we'll get to that, but it's going to be Friday. So. Friday? That soon? Yeah, oh. within five days, if you remember, I read it to you. Am I going to go to jail? I have, like, no oh, priors. All right, like, hey, we're, we're done here. All you got to do sorry, is I'm sign so a few scared. things, and I'm going to explain it, and then we're, you're good to go. You're good to go, all right? what am I signing, you know? I'm this signing. is absolutely nothing that's going to be an admission at Gill or nothing like that. This is administrative paperwork. All right, and you're going to get everything on this You know, I took the breathalyzer for a reason, right? Like, it gives you 90, but I really didn't think that um, I was over 0.8, probably should have ate today. That would help. That probably would help, yeah, but I take Adderall as... This is the copy of the tow sheet. It's just where the vehicle went, which you already know is Soros. Okay. So... And they fixed my car up already. Mm -hmm. It should be there now. So Since this, my hazards was on and my car was locked on the inside, is my car going to be fucking dead when I pick it up tomorrow? Mm -hmm. Everything should be turned off and park. You should be good to go. Alright, so let me explain this. Thank you. So this is an OVI charge here, okay? But what happens is when you blow between a .08 and a .17, by law, I have to charge you with an additional OVI. Okay. Well, you blew 0.096. So that's between 0.08 and 0.17. So that is the only thing you're being charged with is the OVI, A1A section is what we call it, and then A1D, which is just that initial over the limit charge. Okay. Doesn't doesn't mean anything extra in terms of going to jail or anything crazy else happening, right? Like I'm not going to go to Claremont County. Nope. So, um, any questions? Your court date is... Where's that? Where's that? Where's that? Oh, up here. 10-27-23 at 8.30 in the morning at the municipal courthouse. So that's Friday at 8.30. Okay. So from you, it's not a mission to guilt. I just need a signature here and then a good phone number here. Okay. It's sideways, so it's a little weird. And then when you do that, I'll give you your copy.
I'm going to highlight this a little more. I'm sure you won't forget it, but just in case. Okay. Friday at 8.30. You know where the municipal courthouse is? Between, it's between the jail and the sheriff's office on 222, kind of near 32. Familiar with that? Big white building next to you, you, Municipal court. You went to court, I'm sure, potentially, when you and your sister got in that fight. Did you go to court at all? Um, I didn't show up because I didn't want to charge her, and I didn't want to lose my kids, so I didn't fight back. So, so I, it's going to be at the same I let her beat my ass. The address here, the address Until is right here. you guys showed up. Um, the address is right here. Is yeah. it the same place that I went to file um, domestic violence on my baby's father? I oh, went to a police station months. for that. Did you go to a police station for that? Um, no, because they put me in front of a judge then the same day. I like went down to the courthouse I, I about I, I it. I don't know. It could, this is claim I'm, the courthouse would I'm be. I'm a West Sider. Okay, I the live courthouse. Up. Should be municipal court. The address is right there. It's okay. forty four thirty. If I have the address, it's fine. It's, yeah, it's right oh. below your date. So, any questions that I can answer? So just make sure you appear there at that date and time. Okay. Just make sure you appear there. You won't like have a warrant for your arrest or anything crazy as long as you appear. All right. I'm accountable for myself. Yeah. So I'll be there. Okay. Awesome. Anything else? Um, I'm just very scared to go to jail. Not, not that, to jail. not that. I don't know, you probably saw my record. That kid that I asked that was from Milford, um, some weird mishap that just happened that both charges were dismissed. Yeah. I had to turn myself into the Hamilton County Jail on some really stupid bullshit that I didn't I've been do. there, you don't... And you they don't, said, oh, we're there. not going to book you, and then they booked you, and then that yeah. kid... That guy mm -hmm. that I went to high school with booked me, and that was a very disappointing feeling. Mm -hmm. And I just got dismissed off those charges that I didn't do. So this feels like. As long as you're in compliance with that and you're there, there's not. I just don't want this on my record. This is gonna yeah. fuck everything up, man. I worked so hard to get so far, and this is gonna fucking turn my entire life upside down. It's not the end of the world, okay? I, I promise you it's not. It feels like it. Sure it does, and right now, but... So, are, is your ride here yet? Do you know? Is this, um, is this potentially their car? Whatever that is. Ouch. Sorry, is it a black Nissan? No. Then Can you no. get a hold of them real quick and see where they're at? Um, yeah, they were coming from Eastgate, and he was leaving his grandma's house, so he takes care of his grandma, so he was... Um, they actually might be here. He said, where do I go? The, up there in the front lot. He said, I'm here, where do I go? Should I say, you have to come to the front lot? Yeah. 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 Sarah, follow me. Um, he's going to run you out front. Yeah. 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 He's going to run you out front. You might not We're done, okay. You're inside. Just walk. Oh, um, they might be in our lobby. We'll, we'll find them. Um, probably in the lobby. The officers are not going to be fine. Okay, well, I'll see you in the morning. Up the stairs for me. Who, who's picking you up? It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. I'll make sure that we know who, who you're going to and you know who they are. That's important. What do I do? It's okay, Tara. When I go to court, the house is ever going to come off my record. Like, what do I do? Just fine. Like, what do I do? It's okay. Like I said, it's just a mistake. Um, it's okay. I just make sure you attend that court date, right? Do you mind if I just get your name? Braden Hart, you need my ID? No, just need to make sure I know. Braden Hart. Alright, sounds good. Alright. I mean, I can give you my ID. No, you're good. Alright. We just gotta make sure that she knows 
who she's going with, and we have documentation of it. Yes, sir. Appreciate you stopping.